You're about to close a deal, but the last thing you wanna do is sign up for yet another expensive subscription service like DocuSign just to grab a signature. Sound familiar? Well, I was in this exact same situation. In this video, I'm going to show you how I found a better way to send digital signature requests for completely free. I'm Kevin, and on this channel, I help entrepreneurs like you make more, spend less, and work less. So I needed a client agreement signed, but I didn't want to break the bank. So I started looking for a solution, and what I discovered was that all of the signing platforms I was looking at only offered limited free trials. But after testing a bunch of tools, I found SignWell, which actually offers a free forever plan and provides digital signatures, which are legal in over 180 countries. I got my deal signed in minutes, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can do the exact same thing. I'll walk you through setting up your account, uploading your documents, and then sending them out to get signatures, all without having to whip out your wallet. I'm gonna jump right into it and show you how it works, and then I'll show you how you can get your free account. So here we are in the SignWell dashboard and you can see two documents that I've already sent out for signatures that are now completed. And then you have the option to upload a document or use a saved template. I'll come back to this save template option. I'll show you how to upload a document first. So all you need to do is hit upload document, select the file on your computer. I'll pick something simple here just as an example. And in a few seconds, it's actually going to upload that document and you can upload more than one if you want. Then all you need to do is hit continue. And then you just need to add yourself if you want and whoever else is going to be signing it. I'm gonna add myself another email to show you that signing experience. And so you can see it right there, hit prepare next. Then it couldn't be easier, of course you'd modify your own contract to have all the right things in it. This is just a sample template, but all you really need here is, and this is what you're here for, is how do you make it signable? So in this field, you'll see yourself and the person you are sending this out for a signature. Let's start with ourselves, And then you hit the signature box right here. And in this case, you are the marketer say in this agreement, done. Next, text field, done. Then date field, done. That's it. Then go over here, switch to the person you're sending it to. Same steps, signature, done, text field, done, and date field, done. You can drag things around if you wanna reposition it and literally you're done, that's it. So you can just go send, send document and it will send it immediately to the person. And you can make a custom message here if you'd like. I like to do that personally to just make it a little bit more personal, right? But you just hit send and that is it. Then hopping back to our dashboard, we can see the status of it right away. We can see that it's been sent. If you want to sign first, you can just click on it, go to sign now, and then you can execute your part of it. You can add a signature, really easy. You can upload one, draw one or type one, and then add your name, add the date from the picker, agree and finish, done. And then when we go back to our dashboard, we'll see in progress because we can see that one of us signed it, but not the other person. Now I'm gonna hop over to my email and show you the other person's experience, which is absolutely the same thing. So you'll see that they get an email from the system. All they have to do is view and complete document. I'm gonna open this in an incognito tab so they don't need any logins or anything. And then they would go in here, Kevin Tester, save, text, save, date field, save, text, test, date field, pick it, agree and finish, done. That's it, that's how easy it is for both parties to sign. Now hopping over to our view here, we can see that it's completed. We can click on it and everything's good. You just got your document uploaded and signed in minutes. If of course your client signs it right away, <laughs> but it is super easy for them. Earlier I mentioned templates and I wanna show you that now. So just click templates. And what's awesome is even with the free plan, you can use templates, which basically let you set up documents that you can use over and over if you have some very common documents that you like to send. So you can upload your first template here and it'll save it. But what I find really cool is they actually have a library of free templates you can use to get you started. So just click download and customize one here and you can see a ton of options here for a lot Lot of different use cases. Let's say you needed a video release form. Then you just click on that and you get the document and you can modify it as you see fit. 
and there you go. You just save this and upload this into Signwell, and then you can use it either as a template or as a regular document one-off that you're sending to a client. And when it comes to templates and modifying them for you, here's a little trick I like to do. Go to ChatGPT, upload the actual file, and then simply tell ChatGPT to add the sections or what elements you want to cover. Let's say you wanted something like add a clause that says we can mutually cancel with 14 days notice. I'm just giving you a simple example here. And then there you go, boom. You can just copy this element right back into the document and you're good to go. And so you can use ChatGPT as your light lawyer. That's not to replace legal advice to be clear, <laughs> but if you're doing simple things, ChatGPT can make that go even further. And so now your templates, you're modifying them with ChatGPT's help. A little bit of a side tip, but I really like that one, so I wanted to give it to you. Now let's jump back into Signwell. And now I wanna show you how to sign up for Signwell. You just have to come to this page right here. I've linked it down below for you. And then all you have to do is either sign up with Google or sign up with your password. It takes 30 seconds. There's no credit card needed. And then you are good to go. But I wanna show you that this is actually free. So if we go over to pricing, we can see that there is a free plan that allows you to send three documents per month. So that's not three documents in total, that's three per month. That means that if you only send out one, two, three documents a month, then you could use this indefinitely for free. Like personally, I send out a few contracts a month and I haven't had the need to upgrade yet. And this is unique because if we head over to DocuSign, we can see you only get a 30 day signature and their pricing starts at $13 a month. And the same thing with Dropbox Sign, Hello Sign, it used to be called, there is a $20 plan Plan, but there is no free plan. It's just a free trial. And all of the other major signing apps I found have this exact same situation where it's not free. Actually, it's a free trial. And yes, of course, there are functionalities in these higher tier plans that maybe you'll need now or maybe in the future. But if you're just trying to send contracts out quickly, get them signed so you can move on, then this is completely fine. Like I said, you can even use the templates feature. So it is a really well packaged free plan that doesn't feel limited. But of course, in the future, if you need more than three contracts a month, or you really do want some of these other plans, then of course you can upgrade and doing so is still a third or a quarter of the price of something like DocuSign, because you can see it's $8 a month here with Signwell. And hopping over to DocuSign as an example, to get the same unlimited number of contracts is actually $25 a month. So that's actually less than a third of the price. Yes, of course, all of these tools have nuanced differences between them, but effectively they're all just signature tools, right? They're a commodity in a sense. So in my opinion, I just go with something that works very well and it's easy to use and it's free or very cost effective. That's really my MO. And speaking of easy to use, that part is really, really important too. Cause if you look at DocuSign, it looks like it was built in like 1995. <laughs> I'm all for paying for the right tools for the job, but if there's a way to use a tool for free and use it until your business grows enough for you to justify the tool, then that's the best way to de-risk your investment there. And another trend I've seen is that there are hardly any free forever plans anymore. This was a lot more popular 10 years ago. And so now when you do find a tool that has a free forever plan that's actually pretty decent, then you gotta jump on it because you do know that eventually they are going to make it into a trial and then it won't be free forever. But usually what happens is the free forever people get grandfathered in. So you get to keep your plan. It's just new people can't get it. So if you are interested in signing up, you should do it now. If you found this video helpful, do me a favor and hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more content just like this. And speaking of free tools, check out this completely free social media post generator video right here. I'll see you in there.